Hi guys, so today we're gonna be doing another little upcycling um, sewing video. Um, if you guys saw this video, we upcycled a little button up. Today we've got a new shirt that I thrifted for $7. Um, I thrifted it at a yard sale. Um, I thrifted it at a yard sale um, and we're gonna be upcycling it. Let me show it to you and then I'll kinda tell you my goal. But here is the shirt. Um, when I originally bought it, I honestly thought that like maybe it would be just long enough to have like have it be like a mini mini dress kind of situation. But it's definitely not gonna be. So what I'm thinking of doing is cutting and making it a crop top and then making a skirt. So this is gonna be kind of treacherous because especially because one of the only things I have right now is buttons. So like the top will be fine because it's gonna be a, it's got a zipper top up here so that will be easy to kind of get that crop top on and off but getting the skirt to work is gonna have to be button based so that's what we're gonna work with today i've been to those but my sewing skills are like not perfect but that's why i want to do like the upcycling thing so i just finished like hemming a pair of pants so the um thread that's in there right now is black so i'm going to just like when i'm sewing i'm going to try to make sure i get as close as i can to like the edge um but i honestly don't think it's gonna bug me too much so here's it on right now like if i walk all the way back you can kind of see that it kind of just like ends so like i know it'll fit my waist because it goes down but like if i'm lifting up my hands and stuff like this is not going to be like a little moment so i think what we're gonna do is let's see let's like wear it kind of I think I'm gonna have to put it on back inside out and then I wanna like cinch the side and then decide to cut. I think maybe I cut it and then, I, I think what we do is cut the top, hem the top, try back on the top inside out and then we can cinch it. And then we'll tackle the skirt, which is kind of what I'm thinking. But I have to decide like what is gonna be the best place for me to cut, I think. Okay, like here-ish. So I'm gonna say like, I'm gonna just like, what I'm gonna do is, is I'm just gonna use one of these handy dandy um, uh, things, which might I add my boyfriend's mom bought me. She bought me these, which are really helpful. And then she bought me these little scissors, which I couldn't find for a while because I was hemming pants, I think right before, no, like a couple weeks before she got into town for a little trip. And then, well, our friend was staying with us. I don't know. If you guys saw that in the other video, you know what's, what happened. But anyways, I, like, was hemming pants, and I didn't get to this pair of pants. And... Sorry. I didn't get to this pair of pants that I did today. But anyways, these fell behind the desk, and I couldn't find them, and I was, like, sad. I was, like, well... Anyways, so we're going to, like, cut right below that is what I'm thinking. Maybe we'll do it right above. Yeah. Okay. So now we've got this, which is going to be hopefully a mini skirt. I don't know. Okay, I know this looks crazy for a second because my pants are down, but like it could be a mini skirt, but like a really short one. But I think I might have to like add something to it to make this work. Because this is really, like it, from the front it looks really good, but from the back I'm like. Okay, let's hem this top I think. I'm gonna like just turn it inside out and then pin it like barely and then try it on and just see if I like that pin. crop we're working with right now and I feel like if we cinch it a little bit more after we like hem this much 
it will be pretty golden. If you ask me. But I mean, even this is like really cute. Okay, I'm gonna put on a YouTube video while I sew this, but we're gonna just sew this hem real quick. All done sewing it. Let's see. I think it looks pretty good. Okay, now I'm gonna put it on inside out and then decide whether we're going to cinch it so like it's more of like a this fit yeah let's try it so here it is now i think i kind of want to cinch it so what we need to do is zip it up which is kind of going to be awkward because let's see okay and then we've got to decide how we're gonna Okay, so now I need to make sure that I can A, get it off with it cinched like that kind of. It's gonna be cinched a little bit more up here. So maybe I should like just have like a mock one really quick, just for testing. And then I'm gonna take it off and repin them again and make sure that it's even. We have to make sure that it's even on both sides. Yeah, okay. Okay, so the issue now is that um, the it's a little bit too tight if I pin it that much. If I pin it the way I want. So. We're going to just have to think about this a little bit. I'm just adjusting the pinning and seeing what maybe could work. If I do it right after the two. Okay, here's the new one. And I do like how this fits. It would, in theory, also zip up. But it's a lot easier to get on. And it fits better. So, let's sew her up. Okay, top is finished. I just have to cut off the excess from in here, but like, dude, this looks awesome. And like, I think everything looks great. I don't know. How freaking cute. Okay, so now we have to tackle the skirt. So this is gonna be where things get kind of treacherous. Let me change it back. So we have to figure out the skirt. So the issue is, is that like I can't leave the top part like this. And then if I hem it, it's going to be so, so short. So we have to decide what we're going to do. Because I want a skirt, but it's like there's so not a lot I can do. And like, I think this would be really fun if I could figure out a way to like lay this out. We're going to just figure this out. Hold on. See if like, if, let's actually, let's decide what, I really think this could be really cute. Okay, we're gonna make it, it's gonna happen. Okay, we're gonna have to hem, I'm gonna find, figure out this hemming really quick. Hello, okay. So the tea is, is that I dipped for a minute and you guys didn't know this, but I don't know why I'm going like this and that's horrible. But, I left for a few minutes and I went a few minutes. I left for like an hour. And I went and um door dashed and I made $22. Awesome. Anyway, I'm like so hungry. I really wanted to get food, but me and my boyfriend had in and out for lunch, which means I have to eat what's in the house today for dinner. I'm gonna eat some chips while I'm doing this, but I wanna, I'm determined to finish this project. I 
Mm. I gotta get this done. I'm gonna finish pinning this off camera. And then I've got an idea of how I want to do the rest of it with the yellow. So I'll tell you guys when I'm done with this. Yeah? I've been munching. I've been munching on my chippies. Anyway. This is pinned. It looks like slightly off, but it's not that deep, okay? I'm gonna sew this, hem this, and then I'm gonna measure out this yellow um, tablecloth that I got from my grandma. And, sorry, I gotta stop eating while I'm filming. And I'm just gonna do like a little like bit on the top of this, of this, so the skirt bottom remains the same. And then just add a little yellow to the top is what I'm thinking. But let me hem this real quick. I'm not going to film this though because you guys have seen too much of me hemming. And it's like, whatever. It's 100% slightly slanted. You can't really notice like the black hemming too much. because, Which is good because I kind of fucked it up just a tiny bit. the supplies that I'm gonna need. Let's head to the floor. Okay, so I made this a big loop. So what I'm gonna do is, is I'm gonna put it on and then I'm going to, I'm gonna put it on inside out, but I did it inside, oh no. So here's what's happening. I'm going to do like kind of a different thing than what I was thinking, but I think it's gonna be even better. So in order to do that, I'm going to hem the top section and then I'm going to test out the thing. I'll film me testing it out the next time. Um, I just, I don't know. I'm just like so overwhelmed. I just have to get this done. So we're just gonna, I'm just gonna hem this real quick. Bear me. Okay, here's the full look, but I'm not done yet. So. Yeah, so here's what kind of my thought process right now. I was just telling my mom about it, so I put the top on. But this is kind of the look that we're going for right now in terms of the skirt. So what I think I'm gonna do is, so I'm gonna like decide where this needs to like kind of start, but I'm gonna sew the top half to the bottom half. Um, but I have to be kind of careful there. And then I think I might just like leave most of this loose. Um, and then, um, I don't know. I just can't decide about the top piece because I have to figure out a way to cinch this um, because I it is just a little big in the back. And I found this like button that matches the brown like pretty perfectly. So I think I'm just gonna put like a button back here. I think, or I could do a clear button. But I feel like the brown and the yellow like as a button is so cute. So I'm just gonna like, maybe, I don't know. I think I'm gonna have to sew this and then decide whether I'm gonna sew this or just add the button and not do anything else. But I want it to like sit right over my butt, I think, or like barely over my butt. Cause I want it to be like a belly, like a little belly button moment, but I want it to also be, I'm literally so tired. So tired. Hey guys. So it's a new day. Um, it's a new day, and I'd like to say that. Start by saying that. Um, it's a new day. Anyways, um, I had I I fucked up the skirt. Um, yesterday, a little bit. I'm just gonna like point the camera down, but also like hold on. You gotta see what's happening. Right now. I might have to pause that, but it's got nine minutes, so I'm, you're gonna have to just deal with it. Cause I'm doing there's something in the washer. But anyways, I had to seam rip like all these little bitties from when I was seam ripping. It's just a hot mess over here. But anyways, we've got you right here. Point this down. Okay, 
time. So it like, I ran out of bobbin thread and I had to redo some stuff, but we might be, we may or may not be in a better place is kind of what I'm thinking, but just give me a second and I'll I'm gonna take all these off. Trimming threads, really putting in the work right now, guys. This took me too long and I'm so tired. And you know, I know that I got into, I love sewing for the long haul, but like, Jesus Christ. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna put the skirt on now to test it. So hold on, just close it, close your eyes. So we're running into our issue that we were talking about earlier where the skirt, um, the back of the skirt needs a button. So I picked out this brown button that I'm gonna use. But for one, I don't know how to add buttons to the, I mean, I do know how to add buttons to things, but. Okay, I'm gonna have boyfriend. Hi. I'm gonna have my boyfriend, Tyler, put a pin. You just called boyfriend? Yes, boyfriend. Hi, boyfriend. Um, put a pin, <laughs> I'm gonna get hate for that. I love, you. <laughs> I love you, my boyfriend. Um, will you put like maybe this pin, like right where in the middle where it needs to be like cut, for the button? Okay. <sighs> All right. Here's what we have to do. Set that to the side. What we have to do, which is so fucking angering and unfortunate, is that I have to. Rethread a bobbin so then it's all white because if it's not all white then like it's just gonna look weird okay so now we're gonna get the button on there this one I'm gonna have to do by hand okay I'm done I officially finished it I don't know if it looks good I don't know if it's something that looks okay or what, but the front looks good. Here's the front, here's the back, here's the back with the button. I didn't end up sewing to make the like buttonhole better, but I don't care. So I'll be right back, I'm gonna go change. Okay, here's the finished look. Um, so here's my consensus, um, the back, is like not great, but the front looks great. So I think I definitely want to use this for like a photo shoot, maybe like for my 21st or something, or like a cute photo shoot is like one thing, but the back, like the button thing is like not really going that great. And I tried to like cinch it, sew it. And that didn't work that well either. Like I tried to like sew it and then keep the button. Um. But I was just like trying to, it's like, yeah, I gotta, I want it cinched more, but also I have to be able to get it on is my issue. You know, like I kind of just need a zipper is what I'm fucking hearing, but the button was the only thing that I had. So maybe at some point if I can figure it out, I can like seam rip what I had done so far with the button and then just add a zipper. But this is the look. Um, I'm done filming this because it took me too long. So I'm gonna take a thumbnail and um, yeah. But anyways, hope you guys like this video. Give it a thumbs up. Maybe I'll try making some more stuff, but I really like the way this top came out. Like it's perfect. And I love the skirt. It's just the button thing. And like, honestly, if I could get, get over the fact that I think it looks weird, or if I could just add like a zipper instead, it'll be fine. I had a zipper and I don't know where it went. So I just should get a zipper, add that to it. But right now it's probably gonna go in a little archive of like outfits and I wanna take a photo shoot in because it's so cute. I'm actually obsessed with it. But anyway, I gotta take a thumbnail and I will talk to you guys later in the next video. I hope you guys liked it. Bye.